Did you know that the secret to transforming life's challenges into opportunities lies in a simple yet powerful philosophy? It's called Amor Fati, a Latin phrase meaning love of fate. Imagine navigating through life's twists and turns with grace and resilience, embracing every experience, both the highs and the lows, as essential threads in the tapestry of your existence. If you want to unlock a deeper sense of peace and fulfillment, you need to embark on the journey of embracing Amor Fati. This philosophy not only empowers you to accept your circumstances, but invites you to find joy and growth in every moment, no matter how daunting it may seem. So, let's explore how you can make this transformative mindset a core part of your life. 1. Understanding Amor Fati Imagine for a moment waking up to a bright sunny day. You feel energized, ready to take on whatever life throws your way. The world is filled with endless possibilities and you can almost taste the excitement in the air. This feeling of joy can be fleeting though. It's easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle, focusing on plans and expectations and suddenly find yourself stuck in a traffic jam or dealing with an unexpected setback. How often do we find ourselves frustrated, questioning why things went wrong? In those moments, we crave control, yearning to steer our lives in the direction we envision. But what if I told you that the secret to peace and resilience lies not in fighting against fate, but in embracing it? Let's dive deeper into the philosophy of Amor Fati, a Latin phrase that translates to love of fate. It's a concept that has echoed through the ages, embraced by some of history's greatest thinkers. As we explore this powerful idea, I want you to reflect on your own life. Can you think of a time when you faced a challenge that felt insurmountable? Perhaps it was a job loss, a relationship that fell apart, or an unexpected health issue. How did you respond? Did you fight against the circumstances or did you find a way to accept and learn from them? As we navigate the complexities of our lives, it's crucial to understand that every experience, both good and bad, contributes to the rich tapestry of who we are. Amor Fati teaches us to find value in every moment, even when life doesn't go as planned. This philosophy may seem daunting at first, but it's not about passive acceptance. It's an empowering call to action, urging us to actively engage with life as it unfolds. Think back to your own experiences. Have you ever been in a situation that initially seemed negative, but later turned out to be a blessing in disguise? Perhaps a missed opportunity led you to a path you never would have considered otherwise. As you reflect on these moments, let the idea of Amor Fati sink in. Embracing your fate doesn't mean suppressing your emotions or ignoring the difficulties. It means acknowledging them and choosing to find meaning and purpose within them. 2. The Essence of Amor Fati Now let's explore the essence of Amor Fati more deeply. Imagine sitting quietly, reflecting on your life's journey. You might feel a wave of nostalgia wash over you as you recall both the high points and the low points, the moments of joy and the times of struggle. This journey has shaped you, molding your character and resilience. With each experience, you've learned lessons that have brought you closer to the person you are today. Amor Fati invites you to embrace this journey in its entirety, celebrating every twist and turn as integral parts of your life's narrative. At its core, Amor Fati encourages us to accept everything that happens to us, not just the pleasant moments. Picture yourself as an artist, creating a masterpiece on canvas. Each stroke, whether dark or light, contributes to the final image. Similarly, Every event in your life is a brushstroke on the canvas of your existence. Some strokes may feel harsh and overwhelming, while others bring joy and color, but together they form a complete picture. 
This perspective fosters a sense of appreciation for life's complexities, helping you cultivate gratitude for even the most challenging experiences. Now let's evoke curiosity. How does one cultivate this mindset? It's easier said than done, right? The journey toward embracing Amor Fati often begins with a single step, acceptance. Acceptance can feel uncomfortable at first. It's human nature to resist change, especially when it feels unwelcome. But think back to those moments in your life that seemed insurmountable. What if you had approached them with a mindset of acceptance? What opportunities might have unfolded before you? Exploring these questions can help you understand the transformative power of embracing your fate, igniting a curiosity within you to explore this philosophy further. 3. Amor Fati versus Simple Optimism As we dive into the contrast between Amor Fati and Simple Optimism, let's start by recalling the last time you faced disappointment. Perhaps you invested time and energy into a project that didn't pan out, or a relationship that ended unexpectedly. At that moment, you might have felt a surge of emotions, frustration, sadness, maybe even anger. It's a common reaction, and it's perfectly natural. But how often do we leap straight to optimism in the aftermath? Everything happens for a reason, we tell ourselves, hoping that by looking on the bright side, we can somehow mitigate the pain of loss. While optimism has its merits, it often falls short of the deeper wisdom embedded in Amor Fati. Amor Fati doesn't just urge us to remain hopeful, it calls us to love our fate, embracing every facet of our experiences, whether they are favorable or challenging, reflect on this. Can you remember a time when mere optimism didn't suffice? It's easy to dismiss negativity and put on a brave face, but true resilience requires us to confront our emotions and integrate them into our understanding of life. When we view life through the lens of Amor Fati, we're not just wearing rose-colored glasses, we're actively engaging with the reality of our circumstances, seeking growth within every setback. Curiosity peaks when we consider the implications of this philosophy. What does it mean to not only accept, but also love our fate? It's a profound shift in perspective. Imagine looking at a missed opportunity, and instead of feeling regret, you ask yourself, what can I learn from this? Or how might this lead me to something even better? This deeper engagement fosters resilience, allowing us to navigate the unpredictable waters of life with grace and wisdom. It challenges us to go beyond surface-level positivity and dive into the rich, often messy complexity of our existence. 4. Real-Life Applications Navigating Career Setbacks Picture this. You've been working tirelessly for years, pouring your heart and soul into your job. You've sacrificed countless weekends, spent late nights at the office, and invested in your professional development. The day arrives when you finally receive that promotion you've long coveted. The sense of happiness and accomplishment washes over you, and you can almost hear the cheers from friends and family celebrating your success. But then, imagine the scene changing abruptly. After a few months of exhilaration, the company announces layoffs. Suddenly, you find yourself sitting in a dimly lit conference room facing your manager, who delivers the gut-wrenching news. Your position has been eliminated. In that moment, your heart sinks. All the hard work, the sacrifices, the dreams you had for your future seem to evaporate in an instant. How could this happen to you? This overwhelming wave of frustration and confusion is a relatable experience for many. You're not alone in feeling blindsided by circumstances beyond your control. It's easy to get caught in a spiral of why me or what did I do wrong as emotions swirl around you. This is where the powerful concept of Amor Fati comes into play. When faced with such profound disappointment, the idea of loving your fate may feel impossible. 
However, this philosophy doesn't ask us to deny our feelings or gloss over the reality of our situation. Instead, it encourages us to embrace the experience, however painful it may be. Think back to your own life. Have you ever encountered a setback that ultimately led you to a new opportunity? Maybe losing that job opened the door for you to explore a different career path or inspired you to pursue that passion project you had been putting off for years. This reflection can shift your perspective from viewing setbacks as roadblocks to seeing them as potential catalysts for growth. To apply Amor Fati in these tough moments, start with acceptance. Accept the reality of the situation, acknowledging the disappointment without judgment. Allow yourself to feel the emotions that arise, anger, sadness, confusion. These feelings are valid and part of the healing process. After giving yourself the space to grieve, begin to reframe the narrative. Instead of seeing yourself as a victim, consider the situation as a chance for new beginnings. What skills do you have that could be repurposed in a different field? What passions have you neglected that you can now explore? By asking these questions, you invite curiosity into your experience, opening your mind to the possibilities that lie ahead. Now, Let's consider a real-world example that illustrates this philosophy. Think about Steve Jobs, the visionary co-founder of Apple. He faced a staggering setback when he was fired from the very company he helped create. At that moment, he could have chosen to wallow in self-pity and frustration. Instead, Jobs embraced his fate, recognizing that this turn of events was not the end, but rather a new beginning. He famously said, I didn't see it then, but getting fired from Apple was the best thing that could have ever happened to me. This period of his life allowed him to explore new creative ventures, ultimately leading him to found Pixar and return to Apple with fresh perspectives. This story serves as a powerful reminder that embracing Amor Fati can turn a perceived disaster into an opportunity for reinvention. In your own life, when faced with career setbacks, practice reframing your story. Acknowledge the pain, but challenge yourself to find the silver lining. What new paths could this open for you? What personal growth can you pursue? By shifting your mindset, you start to transform obstacles into stepping stones, enabling you to move forward with resilience and determination. Five, the transformative power of Amor. Fati. Now, let's delve deeper into the transformative power of Amor Fati. Imagine standing at the edge of a vast ocean, the waves crashing against the shore, each one unique and unpredictable. Life is much like this ocean, full of ebbs and flows, surprises and challenges. In moments of difficulty, it's easy to feel overwhelmed by the chaos. But what if you could approach the tumult with a sense of peace and acceptance? This is the promise of Amor Fati. When you embrace your fate, you're not merely resigning yourself to the whims of life. You're actively engaging with every experience as a part of your journey. Think back to a time when you faced a significant challenge. Perhaps it was a personal loss, a health scare, or a major life change. How did you respond? Did you resist the situation, trying to cling to what you wished had happened? Or did you find a way to accept the reality of it and seek growth within? Reflecting on these experiences can bring a sense of nostalgia as you recall the lessons learned and the strength you discovered within yourself. As you journey through life, Amor Fati serves as a powerful tool for transformation. It empowers you to see setbacks as opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. Consider how this perspective allows you to cultivate resilience. Each time you face adversity with an open heart and mind, you strengthen your ability to bounce back from future challenges. It's like building a muscle. The more you practice, the stronger you become. Imagine this. You're navigating through a difficult period in your life, feeling weighed down by burdens. 
But instead of succumbing to despair, you remind yourself of the power of Amor Fati. You start to reflect on the ways you've grown from past hardships. Perhaps a difficult breakup taught you invaluable lessons about self-love, or a job loss nudged you to pursue a passion you had buried. By embracing your fate, you empower yourself to take charge of your narrative. Curiosity arises as you begin to wonder how you can apply this philosophy to your everyday life. What if, instead of resisting discomfort, you welcomed it? What if you viewed challenges as essential components of your growth story? You might find that each struggle becomes an invitation to discover more about yourself. You become more attuned to your emotions, learning to navigate them with grace and wisdom. The transformative power of Amor Fati is not just about enduring hardships, it's about thriving in the face of them. When you learn to love your fate, you become a co-creator of your life's narrative. You start to understand that each experience, good or bad, contributes to your unique journey. This realization can be incredibly liberating, allowing you to approach life with a sense of adventure rather than fear. Consider how this shift in mindset can impact your relationships as well. When you embrace your fate, you cultivate empathy and understanding for others facing their struggles. You recognize that everyone is navigating their own ocean of experiences, and by sharing your journey, you create deeper connections with those around you. This sense of community can foster resilience and support, reminding you that you're not alone in your challenges. 6. Benefits of Embracing Amor Fati Now, let's explore the benefits of embracing Amor Fati in greater depth. Imagine waking up each day with a sense of clarity and purpose, unburdened by the weight of expectations. When you embrace your fate, you unlock a wealth of benefits that enhance your mental well-being, resilience, and overall life satisfaction. First, think about the reduction of stress and anxiety. Life can feel like a never-ending race, with pressures piling up from work, relationships, and the uncertainties of the future. How often do we find ourselves ruminating over things we can't control? The beauty of Amor Fati lies in its ability to teach us the art of acceptance. When you learn to embrace your circumstances, you free yourself from the exhausting struggle against reality. Imagine how liberating it would feel to release the tension that comes from fighting against what is. This shift in perspective allows you to conserve your mental energy for the things you can influence, transforming stress into calm resolve. Next, let's consider the cultivation of resilience. Life is unpredictable and challenges are inevitable. Instead of dreading adversity, Amor Fati empowers you to view each challenge as an opportunity to practice resilience. Reflect on a time when you faced a setback, perhaps a failed project or a missed opportunity. How did you respond? By applying the principles of Amor Fati, you can reframe these moments as chances to grow stronger. Each experience becomes a building block for your emotional resilience, enabling you to bounce back faster and approach future challenges with curiosity rather than fear. Additionally, embracing Amor Fati enhances your problem-solving skills. When you resist reality, your focus narrows limiting your ability to see creative solutions. By accepting situations as they are, you open your mind to new possibilities. Imagine facing a difficult problem at work. Instead of spiraling into anxiety, you ask yourself, how can I use this situation to my advantage? This shift in mindset invites innovative problem solving and unexpected opportunities, allowing you to navigate challenges with confidence. Another significant benefit of embracing Amor Fati is the development of greater emotional intelligence. When you learn to observe your emotional reactions without being controlled by them, you become more adept at navigating your feelings. Acknowledge that it's okay to feel frustrated or disappointed when facing difficulties. 
Amor Fati encourages you to understand the source of these emotions and choose how to respond. This heightened emotional awareness not only enhances your personal well-being, but also improves your relationships. Imagine responding to criticism with curiosity instead of defensiveness, asking yourself what you can learn from the feedback. This level of self-awareness fosters better communication and understanding, enriching your connections with others. Furthermore, embracing Amorfati anchors you in the present moment. When you constantly resist what is, you may find yourself living in an imagined future or regretting the past. Amorfati brings you back to the now, allowing you to fully engage with your current reality. This mindfulness practice fosters gratitude for the present moment, helping you appreciate the beauty in everyday experiences. Picture yourself savoring a simple cup of coffee, feeling the warmth of the sun on your skin, or enjoying laughter with friends. By grounding yourself in the present, you cultivate a sense of joy and fulfillment that transcends the ups and downs of life. Finally, embracing Amor Fati fosters a deeper sense of purpose. When you view your experiences as integral to your journey, you begin to uncover the lessons that life offers. Each setback becomes a stepping stone towards self-discovery and growth. As you navigate challenges with an open heart, you start to align your actions with your values and passions, creating a more meaningful life. This sense of purpose acts as a guiding light, helping you navigate through uncertainty and maintain focus on what truly matters to you. As you reflect on the myriad benefits of embracing Amor Fati, let your curiosity flourish. Consider how you can apply these principles in your daily life. What challenges can you approach with a mindset of acceptance and love? How can you cultivate resilience and emotional intelligence in your interactions? By embracing your fate, you empower yourself to transform your journey, allowing you to navigate the unpredictability of life with grace and authenticity. 7. Practical Steps to Cultivate Amor Fati, as we navigate the complexities of life, Embracing Amor Fati requires more than just a passive acceptance of our circumstances. It demands active engagement and consistent practice. Imagine standing at the edge of a vast forest, filled with uncertainty about which path to take. This metaphorical journey into the forest of life is where you can cultivate your ability to embrace fate fully. The first step is to practice mindful acceptance. Picture yourself in a scenario where things don't go according to plan, a last-minute change at work, a relationship hiccup, or even a missed opportunity. Instead of spiraling into frustration, pause and breathe. Acknowledge the situation for what it is. You might say to yourself, this is happening, I accept it. This acceptance doesn't mean you're giving up, rather. It's a powerful act of recognizing reality without the emotional baggage that often comes with resistance. Over time, this practice can become a natural response, allowing you to conserve your energy for what truly matters, your reaction to the situation. Next, consider reframing negative situations. This involves consciously shifting your perspective. When faced with a setback, ask yourself, what can I learn from this? How might this challenge help me grow? Imagine sitting in traffic on your way to an important meeting. Instead of succumbing to irritation, you could think, this is my chance to catch up on that podcast I've been meaning to listen to. By habitually looking for silver linings, you'll train your mind to see opportunities in adversity. Another key practice is to cultivate gratitude. Take time each day to reflect on what you appreciate in your life, even the challenging experiences. Maybe a recent failure taught you resilience or helped you identify what you truly value. Keeping a gratitude journal can be a transformative exercise. Write down three things you're thankful for each day including those not-so-great moments that pushed you toward growth. This practice can help shift your focus from what's lacking to what enriches your life 
deepening your connection to Amor Fati. 8. Daily Reflection Practice Have you ever found yourself lying awake at night, replaying the events of your day in your mind? As you sift through the moments, some are joyful, while others might feel heavy with regret or frustration. Daily reflection is an opportunity to not just replay these moments, but to learn from them and embrace them as part of your journey. Start by carving out a few quiet moments at the end of each day. This practice can feel like a warm cup of tea on a chilly evening, a comforting ritual that invites introspection. Ask yourself questions like, what challenges did I face today? How did I respond? Where did I embrace my fate? And where did I resist? This process encourages you to confront your emotions, making them less intimidating over time. Reflecting on both your successes and your struggles allows you to recognize patterns in your reactions, leading to greater self-awareness. As you reflect, allow yourself to feel the emotions tied to those experiences. Nostalgia can wash over you as you think about the triumphs and lessons learned. Perhaps you remember a difficult conversation that ultimately strengthened a relationship or a project that seemed doomed but turned out to be a pivotal moment in your career. Each reflection serves as a reminder that every experience, no matter how challenging, is woven into the fabric of your life. This daily practice can also cultivate a deeper sense of presence in your life. By reviewing your day, you become more attuned to the nuances of your experiences, fostering an appreciation for both the mundane and the extraordinary. Imagine savoring the laughter shared with a friend or the satisfaction of completing a task. As you develop this awareness, you'll find it easier to embrace each moment, transforming your perspective on life's unpredictability. 9. Inspired Action and Acceptance now that you've cultivated the mindset of Amor Fati through reflection and gratitude, it's time to merge acceptance with inspired action. Picture yourself at a crossroads where acceptance and ambition meet. It's one thing to acknowledge your circumstances, it's another to take steps forward with intention and purpose. After embracing a situation, consider what actions can help you move forward. This might involve seeking new opportunities, learning new skills, or simply adjusting your goals based on your current reality. When you face a setback, instead of feeling defeated, ask yourself, given this reality, what's the best step I can take now? This shift in mindset allows you to take ownership of your journey, reinforcing the idea that you have the power to shape your future despite challenges. Let's say you've recently experienced a job loss. Initially, this can feel like a devastating blow. But through the lens of Amor Fati, this could be seen as a chance to explore new paths you hadn't considered before. Perhaps this is the moment to pursue that passion project or venture into a field you've always been curious about. Taking inspired action means using this change as fuel for your growth allowing you to step into new possibilities with enthusiasm and courage. Additionally, remember that action doesn't have to be monumental. Small, consistent steps can lead to significant change over time. Maybe it's dedicating just 15 minutes a day to developing a new skill or reaching out to someone in your network for advice. Each action reinforces your resilience and commitment to embracing life as it unfolds. As you blend acceptance with action, you begin to see life not as a series of obstacles, but as a journey filled with opportunities. This dynamic approach empowers you to navigate challenges with grace, allowing you to find joy and meaning in the process. Feel free to let me know if you'd like any adjustments or if you'd like to continue with the next sections. 10. The Journey of Embracing Amor, Fati. As we navigate the winding path of life, the concept of Amor Fati invites us to embrace each twist and turn as an integral part of our journey. Imagine standing at the base of a majestic mountain, looking up at its peaks, 
feeling both exhilarated and apprehensive. The journey ahead may be daunting, filled with uncertainties and challenges, but within that uncertainty lies the promise of growth and discovery. Embracing Amor Fati means not just accepting the mountain you must climb, but loving the journey itself, every rocky step of the way. At the outset of this journey, it's common to encounter resistance. You might recall a time when life threw an unexpected challenge your way. Maybe it was a job loss, a breakup, or a health scare. Initially, these experiences can feel like heavy burdens, casting shadows over your aspirations and dreams. It's natural to wish things were different, to yearn for a smoother path. However, as you begin to integrate Amor Fati into your mindset, you slowly start to recognize that these very challenges are not just obstacles, but stepping stones on your journey. Consider a time when you faced a significant setback. Reflect on the emotions that washed over you, perhaps anger, confusion, or despair. These feelings can be consuming, leaving you feeling trapped in a cycle of negativity. Yet, as you engage with the philosophy of Amor Fati, you start to shift your perspective. You learn to ask questions that open new pathways. What can this experience teach me? How can I use this moment to grow? This shift isn't always easy. It takes courage to face discomfort and uncertainty head on. But over time, you begin to see the beauty in the struggle. This journey is also marked by the power of self-discovery. Each challenge you embrace becomes a mirror reflecting your strengths and vulnerabilities. As you navigate difficult moments, you might unearth qualities you never knew you possessed. Resilience, creativity, or an ability to connect deeply with others. Imagine the satisfaction of realizing that you can adapt and thrive even when faced with adversity. This self-awareness not only fosters personal growth, but also enriches your relationships as you learn to support others on their own journeys. As you continue along this path, the concept of interconnectedness emerges. Each experience, whether joyous or painful, contributes to the tapestry of your life. Embracing Amor Fati means recognizing that every thread, every joy, disappointment and lesson plays a vital role in shaping who you are. When you encounter someone else's struggles, you might find yourself feeling more empathetic, knowing that we are all navigating our unique journeys. This sense of connection can transform how you interact with the world around you, fostering compassion and understanding in your relationships. The beauty of embracing Amor Fati is that it encourages you to live in the present moment. Often, we get caught up in the regrets of the past or the anxieties of the future. But when you commit to this journey, you start to find peace in the now. Each moment becomes a canvas, inviting you to paint with the colors of your experiences. You learn to appreciate the richness of your life, recognizing that even the difficult moments hold valuable lessons. Imagine savoring the small joys, a smile from a stranger the warmth of sunlight on your face, or a moment of laughter with a friend. This newfound awareness deepens your gratitude and enriches your everyday experiences. As you progress in your journey, you may find yourself developing a sense of empowerment. The realization that you have control over your responses, even in challenging situations, can be incredibly liberating. Instead of feeling like a victim of circumstance, you become an active participant in your life story. This empowerment doesn't eliminate challenges, but it equips you with the tools to face them with confidence and grace. You begin to see setbacks not as failures, but as opportunities for growth, fueling your determination to keep moving forward. As we wrap up our exploration of embracing Amor Fati, remember that this journey isn't just about accepting what life throws your way, it's about learning to love every twist and turn along the path. By shifting your perspective and finding value in every experience, you can transform challenges into stepping stones for growth.
if you're committed to living a more resilient and fulfilling life, you're already on the right track. Drop a hundred in the comments if you've watched this far. This shows that you're part of the exclusive 0.01% who truly see things through to the end. If you're serious about making positive changes in your life, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insights and inspiration. Together, let's continue this journey of growth and empowerment.